Hey guys! This is making me to make more video longer if you go make me go play three games. Nah. I ain't goofy fruit. What up, what up, coach? MP, we got one heck of a matchup tonight. Reversing the Clippers, let's go. I'm not pitching in for gas money, you don't. There he is. I want an update on Paul. Guess what we're pushing? So I XPPX wanting to get my my target attack, my target is separate. Let me cross him again. How much points will we get? How much points will we get? And Greg, you were talking about this. What do you appreciate about this matchup? The two first first money set on both sides. Very unselfish. And we're going to see guys moving the ball. And Kevin, they play for one another. That's why these clubs rack up so many assists. Come on, Seth Owen. Yeah! And there it is for him. I score over Seth Owen. And drawing first blood, you know Coach likes that momentum out of the game. Well, for us, it will be interesting. Can Seth Owen got played this game. He's up all game long. Oh yeah, Seth Owen again. When you're on the road. Yeah, saw the box score of that game the next day, and I thought, wow, that's a huge scoring night. Pretty impressive stuff there. Here's Champ. The stellar performance against Oklahoma City. Nice again. And the layup by Sharks. Man, that's a lesson for the D. Fight harder on the glass. Yeah, you just can't afford to give up second chance opportunities again and again. Now, here is Robinson. And you can see his scoring totals. Those are some pretty good numbers. He's putting up close to 15 points a game on average. Here's Champ. First quarter to play with the bottom half and a half gone. Van Carroll, that's good. You know, you're going to have success when you can start out shooting 80% from the game. So, early offensively, they've been great. That's the way you like to start. Now, here's Robinson. He's coming off a 13 point game against Cleveland. But there's always this point you got to look at where did he also impact the game? He was on the rebounding end of the floor. And the story here, Kevin, early on is how well they shot the basketball. Owens with it. He had a 27-point outing in the last game against Cleveland. 
felt like he had a sense in that game that the defense was being over aggressive and he tried to take advantage of that. He continually frustrated them throughout the night and got to the free throw line. And he comes up with the deuce. And you can't help but pick their defense apart. They're Token market you get. Another token market, guys. Thanks, we be X. Completely in disarray. Looking to run the one and foul on the shoot. that the confidence on his plays but really fuels him. He thinks he can take on anything or anyone. At this point, you might as well go ahead and chalk up the points when he's at the free throw line. Pretty much automatic. Chance to pass to Van Carroll. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly clean. Just assist. Van Carroll's got his second bucket of the night. When you find yourself up double digits in the first quarter, you know you're doing something right. Well, dominant so far, that's the responsibility of the starters. Now let's see if everybody else who plays in this game makes the same kind of high-level contributions. Nice shot by Arthur. in at the four-man position. And that's the battle they haven't been winning today. Their work on the glass has been... How the heck is that a foul, ref? You need lacing. Shooting for center time, number eight, at the line for two. First free throw is good. From champ. Here's Owens, nails the baby hook. 
I would just enjoy watching Owens play. I mean, he's electric and effective. Tough combination to stop. Here's Champ. Ten points for him. There's the pick. Fires the three. Hands it from downtown. Champ's got 13. No way he's going to pass that shot up. He is way too far back and relaxed and getting out on him. Here's Nojewitz. A rebound by the Spurs. They've led by as many as 14 points. Last time they came together was in Los Angeles, where they fell to the Clippers. Yeah, you, you saw the communication breakdowns defensively. Just giving up way too many open looks. Yeah, sometimes you can play good on-ball defense, but it's the help defense that makes you elite. And on that night, nobody rotating and not a lot of help. Owens dishes to Hart. Champ, he's got 16. The second chance effort, he lays it in. And the Spurs lead by 14. And Matador defense, that's one of the easiest shots he is ever going to see. Yeah, feels like Christmas right now, just gift wrapping things. Let's check in with our reporter, David Alder. Thanks, Kevin. Well, Champ, in their last matchup against Oklahoma City, was all business. He contributed 31 points, and his passing was just incredible. He piled up an impressive number of assists. His numbers were off the charts. He was unguardable, and he knew it. And he took advantage of it. Kevin, back to you. David, we appreciate the update. Greg, we'll see if he can keep rolling here tonight. Yeah, and that's the rub. When he's in rhythm, he can carry your team across the line. And you want to see him make sure that the teammates are also involved in what they're doing, especially if he draws that much attention. Here's Nojowitz after the main shot from Champ. Here's Robinson. No good. That's miss number two. He's one for three. Here's Champ. He's got 18. Passes it to Ivan. Here's Champ. Two minutes remaining. Five to shoot. Inside. Here's Hendricks. He trains it as the shot clock ticks down. Six points for him. I mean, the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye open. Here's Nojowitz. Charge grabs the board. Charge has got five rebounds tonight. Brent, as we all know, you were a former slam dunk contest champion. So with that in mind, what was your take on the 2022 contest? Well, I think there are some great dunkers out there, Kevin, and every year it's like that. I know from year to year it takes a lot of criticism to the contest, and uh, certainly there are years that are better than Time others. But the Time out. Start it. Here's Waters, and down it goes. Dunk through off a wonderful assist. 
Can't talk enough about the subtleties in that setup right there. The assist, really the key to that entire sequence. Here's Champ. Goes back up. And the layup is up and in. And the Spurs lead by 19. have been bored and dominant in this game. That's definitely been a factor in cracking this huge lead. Out to the right wing. Here's Atkins. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. San Antonio with the ball. They're on a 19-6 run. Wasted no time on that one. Champs got 24 points. Love his shot selection. Good at taking quality shots. Whether he's defended or open, he knows how to knock those down. Pass to Lawson. Two free throws and coming up. And they... Thunder. First personal foul. First team foul. Tremendous, and they are shooting lights out with very high accuracy. And don't go away. We'll be right back. Welcome, everybody. The story at the half could be summed up as a dominating performance for the San Antonio Spurs. They're leading because of the work on the offensive glass. Step one, grab the ball. Step two, put it back in their face. Yeah, some teams like to send everyone back on defense. They've taken the opposite approach. Now let's go ahead and recognize the Player of the Month award. Okay. What do you think about our Eastern Conference winner? Look, he's just a beast on the offensive end. You want to slow him down, you got to bring the double, the triple. Oh, yeah, quadruple. Because if you don't, he's going to be out there getting more of these awards. Thank you for being with us. Now let's send it to Kevin Harlan for the second half tip. drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. What a game we're seeing from Champ. And guys, we saw just how tough he can be with the step to the rim. Great job of just attacking that first half. Yeah, nice job of carving his...
way to the inside with some ease. Not much resistance out there. They've got Robinson. And it's in a center position. And he's out there for the Clippers. Now when he's got this floater working, Shep Owens becomes really tough to stop. Now here's Green. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Here's Champ. On loads. Great look there, but off target. Shot didn't fall, but that play worked well to get a good look at the basket. Yeah, an efficient offensive possession. They found the look that they wanted, just didn't go in. And here is Los Angeles now, following the bucket by the Spurs. Here's Owens, again, Los Angeles. And you plan for the drive, but then Owens able to splash the mid-range. Here's Champ, 24 points for him. Screen by Charge. To the inside. A slam dunk by Sharks. There are only few players in the league who can hit a teammate like that in stride. Beautiful assist. Clippers trail by 21. And with that lightning first step of Jalen Green, very few defenders have a chance of keeping him in front. Gives the team such a great element having a one guard who can get to the 10. Uh, certainly something every team wants to have. Like to see that assertiveness, especially from the guy who's going to orchestrate your offense. Here's Champ, and finish up. A five-man peril. Pushing the action, getting others involved. He does it time and time again. Nice to play with a point guard that takes pride in playmaking. It makes you move around just a little bit faster to get open spots. Owens, no good. And Greg, one thing about that winding speed of green, he's got to make his ball. Just a few slowing down for him, though, Kevin. And that and speeding up his shot release uh, will make him even tougher to deal with. Los Angeles making a switch here. Cardinals checked in. Now, here's Owens. Wasted no time on that shot, but it's off the mark. Here's Champ. Over in the corner, Green. And again, it's the Spurs from deep. Yeah, they've only missed one out of their first five shots here in the second half, guys. Their offense really moving well, ball snapping, and the shooting looks to be in great rhythm. And the basket by Owen. And Greg Shep Owens has made a living from the mid-range to... Very soft touch. It's like MP keeps daring him to shoot it, but Owens keeps knocking him down. Might have to update that scouting report. And Green gets it to go. And I like the back and forth here, showing confidence from range. It seems like they're going to find out who can make the deepest threes. Right now, it's a shootout. Now, here's Owen. Two minutes from 15 points in the game. And Owens throws it down. That's a pretty, pretty finish. Owens doesn't shy away from the deep. Here's Champ. He's got 24. Pass to Green. Let's the three fly. And again, it's the Spurs from deep. The defense three a point. step slow. You can see the result. LA has gone one of two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. And now we've got some time to check in from the sideline. You got for us, GA. Thanks, guys. Now Jalen Green is on a mission. He says, every time I step on the floor, I always have something to prove to who's ever in those stands. A lot of people will hate on me or have their opinions. I'm just going to think about that when I step on the floor. I'm going to prove everybody wrong. Kevin? That's a great chip to keep on his shoulder. David, thanks. Yeah, and they show effort and aggression in the paint, really, right from the tip. Their rebounding edge right now, massive. Here's Hendricks. Again, the Spurs, good for two. 
the hole. Selfless play right there from Green. He's all about getting it to the open man. Here's Owens. That one a little long. Anzo Green will bring it up for the San Antonio Spurs. 36 seconds left in the third quarter. Here's Callaway. Good. Great play by Green to set it up. Green's got three assists now in this one. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. And again, it's the Clippers missing. All the energy is on the other side right now, and every miss just makes it work. Well, the other team is scorching hot, and they come down on this end and can't find a way to get the Embers going. Here's Owens. They can't stop the run with that one. That's a shocker there. Did not expect him to miss from that range. He's got to be shooting close to 60% from this. And so it's the San Antonio Spurs. 41. The Spurs. The Spurs shooting a mind-boggling 79% off the floor. On the floor for San Antonio starting the fourth quarter. They've got Ivy. Bryant. Ivy is out there with Champ. Then it's Kaminga. And it's Calloway in at the three. And Los Angeles guys uh, shooting not great. 40% for the game. And there's the pass to Hughes. Here's Waters. Some nice ball movement by the Clippers. Well, Greg, analysts evaluate player performances on the floor, and sometimes we've seen the players fire back. They're not happy with the criticism. You know, it, it's a risk you take, but if you treat everyone with kick gloves, you're really not doing your job. The, the audience expects a level of honesty, and, and quite frankly, Three players don't mind you criticizing their game. It's when those critiques become personal. From 13... Here's Hughes. Uses the glass to finish the layup. His hard work on the backboard really just has given them more opportunities to score. Here's Champ. To the paint. There's Kaminga. And Kaminga throws it down. And the one-hand slam just looks so pretty when it's in his hand and he's the one doing the slam. Not a great. He is smooth as silk, even on a power finish. The shot by Hughes, no good. Here's Waters, makes it off the glass. Just a late reaction there from the defense, and he is always going to finish that one. Here's Champ. Two minutes oh. into the fourth quarter now. Get back. Get back. Get back. Oh, get in the play in the low block, and that one's good. Champ's got 29 in the game. And certainly, Greg MP has done a lot of damage outside the arc in this one. Yeah, he's looked very comfortable from that range, especially when he sees Owens in front of you. Huge. First personal foul. First team foul. Line the All right, MP. <coughs> Let's close this one out. Play yeah, yeah. hey, smart. One shot. Things on offense. I mean, the mid-range area has been made available, and boy, are they taking advantage. All game long, they've just done a great job of keeping the pressure on the defense and penetrating with the pass. They've gotten everything inside, and they've converted there. Here's Owens. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Yeah, Owens isn't letting anyone get in his way, playing with a lot of fire offensively. 
Uh, triple PM. Here's Champ, defended by Bryant. Yep, that one goes. And that's 31 points for Champ. And once they smelled blood in the water, you yeah, could see the killer instinct take over. Yeah, up until that point, a competitive game, but once they broke through that barrier, it was all them. Complete control. And finish off by Bryant. Yeah, at this point, they're just trying to get back in sync. You, you want to play a good brand of basketball. Consistency definitely is a, a key to some of the playoff performing teams, and tonight they just did not find it in this contest. But the truth is they've had control of this game. Yeah, it looks like a veteran team tonight getting out on the road, playing with assertiveness, confidence, fully in control for this one. And so it is. Yeah. 